Hey there, how you doing guys? Um, something um, that I keep hearing a lot is, oh, it's fine, time is a great healer. Okay, I just wonder what time can do for you. Um, time can be, um, it's kind of irrelevant, don't you think? Like, you hear all the time, it is a bit of a story, and we all know I like stories about stuff what we create because it's all like yeah well you want to wait a year after divorce or you want to wait this or you want to do that just to be sure you just want to do that just to make sure you just want to wait and see or you want to get on with it make it get a move on or yeah and you think hang on a sec why are we giving so much power to this time thing yeah um time is not a great healer do you know what is a great healer sorting your shit out yeah and that does that doesn't need time that needs inspired action so what i would say to you is time is something that we have just created and it's a story we tell ourselves like you know this amount of time it requires grief is this is done this way it's this amount of time uh love you must wait three months before you know you're in love do you know what no you might just know you're in love do you know you might just rock it through grief um, and it's other people's perception of what you're doing in the time frame you're doing it that will alter that. So <clears throat> if you deal with grief, say you, you have a massive loss and you deal with grief and then you get through it, it's other people who might have a problem with the time that you're taking or not taking. If you rock it through grief in three days, does that feel uncomfortable? And maybe you just get over it. Maybe you just deal with the root cause of the grief really quickly. And the way that you rock it through trauma and the way that you don't need this time, this elusive time to deal with stuff is you actually, you, you go to the point of trauma. Is it, it, and it, it really is. How quickly can you heal is how well you've already healed. Um, and it's the type of healing you do. So I really would love you to, to if you're going through any kind of time related trauma you know recovery ask yourself is it time that i need or is it a better way to heal that i need because that is when i look at for instance so i i can only look at my clients um how they've dealt with stuff and it's been nothing to do with time it has been being in that moment that you are ready to sort your shit out um and recently I've had the utter pleasure to work with other healers and coaches and things like that. And when they realized, when they could open up enough to realize they hadn't healed yet, it was just so powerful. Um, and, and thus helping their clients even more as well. But um, time is an utter illusion and somewhat of a fallacy when it comes to healing so um if that resonates with that i just got literally got the urge to say that so somebody needs to hear that it's not about time it's about doing it the right way it's about healing um and i thought i was already healed for example um and it wasn't time that changed it it was awareness of what was still wrong and the utter will and want to not have that as part of my life anymore. We can sit around all day thinking, oh, I'll feel better soon. What if you always feel better soon, then soon never comes? You need to start to feel better now for it to even be relevant. So whoever needs to hear that time is not going to change anything action changes things and how you get action is understanding what you actually want and a realization as to what is still wrong that's how action kind of comes about so if that has spoken to you literally send me a message and i'll help you out but i just want you to if you're telling yourself that that time is a great healer you are kidding yourself see what if you whatever you need to heal from look at it own it ask yourself why you've got it
get deep into it, reach out for people for support, but the right people, not someone who's going to listen to you regurgitate your story, reach out to people who know what to do to help you, yeah, um, find your tribe, find your people, reach out to them, and heal, heal like a motherfucker, badass heal, do it, it doesn't have to be painful by the way, it's easy, healing, once you know how, it is an absolute joy, it isn't, it, it is simple, it's not necessarily easy, but it is very simple to do, um, I've literally made it my life's work to make it that simple, but um, anyway, don't use time, get inspired and do it, anyway, loads of love from me to you, I'm just literally writing my book, I've just done it, I'm just doing it, because I want everyone to know the framework with which you can heal, it's so exciting, I've been doing the framework with people now for about a year, and it works. So I've decided to write a book about it so that everyone can have it. Because that's great, isn't it? Everyone can now have a framework to heal their lives. However quickly you want to do it and how easily you want to do it. So there we go. The book will be out. I'm on chapter one. <laughs> There's seven chapters. So um, I'm just, yeah, writing the framework out so everyone can have it. Anyway, with love from me to you guys. Have a great day.